This video is rated E for everyone. Please enjoy the video. What is up, ladies and gentlemen? We're gonna get back into playing Subnautica, but I have no more save file. I had put a lot of time and effort into recording something, and I realized that I did not make any effort, so I lost like a lot of interest in playing the game. But I wanted to do something different. And that thing that I wanted to do different was like maybe, maybe changing the difficulty. But I, I still wanna play in Survivor, so I'm going to. So there's a couple of things that I'm gonna definitely do in this game that I haven't done before. I'm gonna hold escape because I've already seen this part. Yay, okay, a couple of things. Oh cool, I didn't have to put out the fire. Neat. Pop that open, jump right on down. And because I know what I'm doing, I'm not gonna focus purely on where exploration. Yeah, 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 okay. But I do wanna keep a, an eye on my food over on the right. So I'm gonna grab two of these. Grab one of these. I wonder, is this a different landing location? Ah, oh, seems like it might be. That's pretty neat. I'm gonna have to look for a couple of things. It looks like one of the few things that I'm gonna need is to start upgrading my stuff. I need to be able to sit underwater for a long time. First, like this, and that is going to refresh. Fabricator, grab this, basic supplies. Titanium, we need some of those. This will work. We get our first standard tank. Tank unlocked, and it's already attached. Neat. Oh, we can now pin stuff. Oh, neat. Okay, so we need a, to do a scanner. So I need to create a battery. So how do I create a battery? Uh, battery. Neat. Okay. So that's a couple of new things. Um, those weren't in the last time that I played. So now I just look around for some copper. Might be a little hard to find at first, but I'll definitely do my best to find it. I'm not gonna focus on a lot of food. Oh, here we go. Okay, now that we've got this, come over here, craft battery. Craft this down here, scanner. Okay, so next up we can unpin that and unpin. We now have access to the power cell. Uh, let's see, what do we want? We need the repair tool next. So I need to know how to craft those. And once the repair tool comes out, and we'll try to get the sea glide, but we'll worry about that later. Fins, we'll also try to grab that. So let that fade. Now we won't be able to use hardly anything. That's a 29%. Okay. So that middle part, that, that rubber thing, is part of something different. Oh, scan acid mushroom. Apparently I can't scan the quartz. Creature egg, I can also cannot scan, even though it's useful information. Scan this, scan that. And we're just scanning these to get information. That's the more information we get, the better. I think we got everything around. All right, so there's a couple of things I'm gonna be looking for. I'm gonna be looking for one, these. These are very useful. And I'm gonna be looking for like vines. I'm not really worried about fish at the moment. I could scan this thing though. Might be good to have that guy's uh, digits. Primarily looking for stuff that's attached to them. I, I kind of know where they get the sulfur, which is great and all. I don't want to get too far away from the ship. Ah, here's one. I'm up for air. I'm gonna go back to Yeah, I was trying to avoid you. Scan the sulfur plant. Yep, yes it is. I already got two out of the three pieces. Now I just need to look for that weird webbing thing. I say weird, but it kind of looks like algae. It's kind of really easy to find. I say that as I'm struggling to look for it. I want to dismember the stuff I have in my inventory, because I know uh, the thing that I'm going to need to grab is uh, huge. Oh, that's the power thing? Oh, that's neat. It made some really good quality of life changes. How about inventory? This looks a lot bigger than it was before. Hell yeah, I like that. I'm gonna need to get food soon, but I'm not really worried about it at the moment. There's plenty of fish out here that I can easily grab something. Let's grab us a limestone chunk. And I'm not afraid of nighttime. Although, like that was like one huge thing that I hated doing. Ah, here we go. This is what I'm looking for. I, I was so afraid of going out at night 
for no other reason than just, I don't know what's out there, but I haven't really encountered anything that will actually kill me, you know? That's neat. So I need to go up for air. There's the thing I'm looking for. So I'll come down. How many of those did they give me? Wait, did they change that too? No, I just have a lot more inventory space. Okay, I guess that makes a lot of sense. I need those anyway, because I need to craft a lot of that silicone thing, which apparently looks like I can make 12. <laughs> that's uh, that's plenty for me, if you ask me. Man, like, where was this when I was first playing? Holy cow, I would have loved all of that, actually. Uh, we're gonna make you, because I need to make two. And I mean, we can make lubricants now, but I'm not gonna really do that at the moment, but I'm gonna make fins. I'm gonna repair this. Now this goes up 5% every single time. I like that. That's a lot of nines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not gonna do that because I don't have to worry about that, unfortunately. This is also something that I didn't really realize that this game re like requires you to read a lot. If you are just playing this by yourself, it wouldn't be that big of a deal. But as a YouTuber, it kind of becomes almost like a chore. And I'm only saying that because of the fact that there's good information in these, but a lot of this information is going to get cut out of the video to begin with. Now, it looks like I'm hungry. With me being hungry, i will grab some of these fish. It seems like some of these fish don't really like to run away from me, which is great. Uh, we're going to cook the boomerang. And then I'm going to make some water. That'll make it a lot easier for me to hit the cooked fish. Go over here, drink that, and we're stabilizing. eat that. I'm gonna grab a couple of more if they're around-ish. Neat, okay. So now we're gonna cook these two. That's like the best fit, er, fish is. It's like 32 food, ooh yes. That's a lot of food that I just ate there. Now we're going to uh, make some lubricant. I don't need that or that anymore. I'm gonna grab this, silver ore, power cell, copper wire. These things are gonna be really, really helpful later on. Glass, silver ore. I'm gonna need something else in here. I would like to get the high capacity, but I won't worry about that right now. Oh, cool. I can automatically make the uh, the knife. This one, this one, this one. Uh, air bubble, flotation device. Don't need to do that. I think that's all that I can do until I start unlocking more things. I can make the habitat thing with a computer chip, wiring kit, and battery. That's not gonna be the thing I go for first. I will eventually need to go after that. More batteries and more copper wire. For now, this is all that I'm gonna really focus on. I'm gonna take the scanner out and try to see if I can find more blueprints. The blueprints are gonna be what I'm gonna need to travel like quite a bit. And then while I'm out here, I will scan animals as I need. Doesn't look like I need to scan that anymore. Scan the bladder fish. Very good uses for water. Super good uses for water. Of oxygen? Jesus. I'm really sad that I lost all that progress, but you know what? Tell the cookie crumbles, man. Tell the cookie crumbles. But now I have a better idea what I need to do. And that is far easier. Grab this. This has our oxygen. Park myself around on top. Just keep myself. Oh, there's a the thing over here. The fins are equipped, right? This here. And this is salt. Not necessarily anything that I need at the moment, but I'll take it. Laser cutter. Later, laser cutter is really good. That is a creature egg. Yes, it does. But I have to go up for air because I don't have enough oxygen. And there's the big boys. The titans always surprises me. These titans are huge. Okay, do you give me anything? Uh, beacon. Beacons are good. Grav trap. That's good. Ah, here we go. Sea glide. Not the grav trap too. 30 seconds of oxygen already. That's okay. Now that I don't really have anything to be afraid of during the day, and mostly through the night, I'm now able to get through these at a well faster pace. Now we should have this done so I get, yeah, titanium. So there is a little bit of cave system here, which is good, I believe. Sandstone, what do you give me? You are titanium. Yes, 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 I know. Uh, we're gonna go in here and we're gonna change the life pod to yellow. So it's a lot easier for me to see. So we got one copper ore, no silver ore, only one thing of glass, but I did grab one of the quartz. So I should be able to craft something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Grab sulfur, copper, quartz, quartz. Put my eye on my position and where I need to go. I need to head out now. 
I don't have a big enough oxygen tank to stay down here for a long period. Uh, let's get in here. Grav tool and the sea glide. So now I need a battery and copper wire. Conveniently enough, I have enough for the copper wire, but I'll need to grab a battery, which it tells me how to craft it. Thank Christ. And it looks like I only have four things up at a time and I'm, uh, I'm okay with that. I'm honestly okay with that. I'm good on food. I'm also good on water. I need to find uh, two of these, which obviously these are everywhere. I can't unsee those. But now I need to find copper. Are you a cop? No, you're not a copper. Oh, it's gonna be so glad when I can outswim you. Neat. All right, so I got my... Oh, I need more. Go away. I swam away from you. Uh, there's lots of stuff in here. A lot of stuff in here. Holy cow. That... Oh, shh. Whew. Okay, good. I didn't die this time. Although, I don't think I have anything to fear about dying, to be honest. Yes. I will remember that kind of. Okay, so now that I've got the sea glide, I've got the scanner, I've got the repair tool, I kind of need to just explore a little bit more for data things, but we are kind of almost at a standstill. One of these has a code that I have to keep an eye on, which is what I didn't realize they needed to like do where I am. Fabricator, Habitat Builder. Ah, excuse me. Power, solar panel, vehicles, see that, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I'm going to craft these. These are probably good. Another one? Grim looking snake thing? I don't want to deal with that. I, I don't want to deal with that at all. Craft one of those. Cool. Now I just need to find the silver ore and we'll have the high capacity tank thing. Is there anything else that I could possibly craft right now? I need to get these off. So, lubricants. Here we go. Uh, also, another thing that I'm noticing is that my inventory is now starting to get full of stuff. I've created like, was it nine open spaces? But that's gonna clearly fill up with anything else that I grab. All right, so I've got two more locations that I can look for. Um, shallows or three and live pod 17. We're gonna go to three first. So over there, I'm good on food and water. 400 and, well, 400 meters now, less than, so neat. We're doing really good. Wait, I have a map? Oh, that's this. Probably turn it off right now. Lights. I'll probably talk a lot off right now too. I don't really need them. It's a shallow. We're coming back over here, which is neat. I like these. I just got silver. Oh, neat. So it looks like I found Lifecraft 3. I'm further away from the ship, about 475 meters away from where I'm sitting. But finally found this place. Cut crep vine. I probably don't need to have this on. Nah, I'll just stay on the surface. Don't need to have it on if I'm at the surface, right? Continuing? What the hell does that mean? Probably means that the core is gonna go boom. Which that was like the really cool thing when I first played this. Love the core going boom. Coming in here. We're uh, going to make a high quality O2 tank. Ah, now I can make the rebreather, which is pretty neat. What else can I make? Ship status. So this is being updated periodically, which is great. As long as I can still see this, I'm good. And I'm looking for a code. It starts somewhere. Probably get a little bit closer when a uh, thing starts to curse explode. But now we don't need that. We do have the rebreather. So we could get the uh, things, which is fiber mesh, which is this, and wiring kit, which is that. Then we could get a little bit more of that, but Right now, it doesn't really need to, to be there. We can also see the, the sea moth too. We can also make these, but we're gonna hold off on those for right now. These should be fine. Should we get something that uses this then? Uh, I think we'll be fine if we don't grab it now. I am feeling a little bit thirsty. So I'm gonna dismount that. Grab me some food and some water, just to kind of get this out of the way. Drink, drink, eat. Eat. We'll heal ourselves up. This should be ready. Yep. Okay, so we found some silver ore next to the wreck to the location three. So I'll go and finish that up. Where is three? I gotta say, from the last time that I played this, they uh they made a quite a quite a bit of updates that I kinda like. Ah, here we go. So number four. How many can I okay, I can only hold that. Only that much. From the last time that I played this, I was told that stuff respawns. I do not know what the respawn timer is, but I know what I'm looking for. That looks like a, oh, that's a bad fish. Fudge, found gold, fudge. It's titanium, salt deposit, sulfur. 
I want that gold. Copper, I do need that. At least I think so anyway. I'm just looking for silver. If you can tell me where silver's at, I'll, I'm, I'm out. That's all I'm looking for, fishes. Fishy, fishy, wake up. I don't know where the gold went. What was that sound? Oh, nothing. Are you gold? No, you're not even silver. Bye, fishy, bye, fishy. Hurt you, moving away. You're kind of a weird fish. Silver, silver? Oh, what's this? Uh, sea line. So I'll get more fragments. Uh, never mind. Stuff's full. Who knew? <laughs> okay, so I guess we'll go back to the ship. If I, if I built the habitat tool, I can build like a really loose living base over there. And then I could uh, do all my stuff over there with the right tools. Problem is, is that I'm running out of inventory space, which is kind of what happened last time, which was not so fun. But I was told that nothing despawns. Everything that I just tossed on the ground will be there. But that was, fortunately, months ago. Uh, four. Uh, here, here, fiber, which we now have. I still don't have silver. I'm gonna craft that down. What else can I make in here? Fins, which I don't care for. Floating air pump, which I also don't care for. Uh, storage container, which has the stuff in it. That, keep that on me. Store those, those, those. Because I don't need them, right? No. I don't. Yeah, I think it was this way. I think, I think, I think it's this way. Grab that copper. I don't really need any more now. So now all the rest of them I will start skipping because I don't need them. Here's a vine, which I'll definitely grab. Actually, I saw it well before I hurt you. Uh, number three, please. I'm just kind of looking anywhere, really, for silver. Silver could be right down here, too. Oh, vehicle bay. It's actually really good. I found the gold. That's pretty neat. I uh, I don't know what gold's used for yet. Like, I have a strong idea. It's been a bit since I played this game. Like I said, like I had lost like kind of all interest playing at one point in time. More cosmetic stuff. That's copper. I'm not picking up copper, so I don't care. What are you? Titanium. I also don't care. What are you? Titanium. I still don't care. You are salt. That's a fish. That fish will attack me 100%. 100%. That fish is dragging stuff around. Hey! Go away. Don't want you. Another salt. Another salt. I feel like I've been through here already. Hey fishes, do you know where I can find silver? Just looking for silver. I'm not having any like good luck looking for the silver. Ooh. This looks neat. Oops. Looks really neat. Are you silver? You are silver. So I'm looking for a break stone. I found lead, but I did find silver. Silver is down here. So get my oxygen and then I'm going back down. But this time, I kind of remember what it looks like. This time I'm going to try to scan it. That's copper. Whatever my goal was, I beat it by 500%. So that's awesome. It's not limestone. It's not sandstone. What's silver? What is silver? I just need like one more. Titanium. That's salt. Sandstone. Sandstone. That's what I'm looking for. Ha! Neat. All right. I got my sandstone. Yes, I know. I know. I know. I gotta say the biomes though look way different from when I played the first time. I kind of like that. Oh no, that's not good. Means the core is gonna blow up and hopefully that gives me the password that I'm looking for. Aha, I have been studying for how long I've been gone. There's still quite a bit that's a mystery to me, but I have 100% been looking this game up and figuring out where stuff is. I'm still not as proficient as I should be, but I'm a lot better for sure. I'm gonna grab this fish, grab that fish, and that one, cause I'm right here. I'm gonna need to craft another battery soon. Get me three waters, me eat one of the fish, make the wiring kit, and I'm gonna make the rebreather, which should help me out quite a bit. Conserves oxygen when diving deeper, absorbs and recycles CO2 into breathable, breathable air. Neat. And we're just going to drink all that. So the sea moth, for one, is getting low. I think that takes battery. So I do have plenty of that. Uh, floodlight, the uh, Degassi Crew Manifesto, Stalker, the 
drop stinger. Roar ship status. Start here. Uh, nothing so far. But I did get four more uh, wrapping things, so that's pretty neat. That's all down here, though. Cosmetic miscellaneous stuff, obviously. And, oh, there's a uh, thing here. This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam. Aurora, do you read? Over. Yes, I read you loud and clear. I am just fine, just so you know, but I don't want to be here for 999,000 hours. So if you could, please pick me up. 100 meters down. That one's going to be a little bit funny. So two hours, the main ship blows up, and I'm going to grab some of these. Wow, I just looked at the time, and we're actually doing pretty good. So with this, can I... What is the sea glide take? Replaceable battery. Keep finger away from propeller. So it doesn't say that it needs a power battery. It just says replaceable battery. So I'm just going to leave it at that. Just needs a battery. Um... Oh, these go to one through five? Oh, neat. I don't need this one. I don't think. Oh, no, I'll keep it. I'll keep it on there. I might need it. Oh. Well then, I wasn't even using the right tank. I thought it automatically swapped me. Neat. I was wrong. Okay then. Turn off the battery because I don't need that. Uh, question is, what should we do now? Because we know that the ship's going to explode in a couple of hours. Uh, for blueprints, we are kind of dead out of the water. I need to find more, um, what's this? Holographic pathfi uh, pathfinder disks used to map a way back out caves or hard path to navigate spaces. Oh, okay. I don't need that though. I need one more for the vehicle bay, one more for the beacon, and two more for the laser cutter. I think I'm just gonna explore to unlock more things, but I do see that my food and water consumption is like going down quite a bit faster than then. Oops. Than what I'm used to. So that's what I'll do. I will run around and explore. Try to locate the thing I need. Got a beacon. Now what else? What else can I find around here? Salvage parts. Here's a counter, which is taking forever to scan. Some of these parts have something else gadged into them. It's pretty neat. And now that I got the high quality tank, I can stay underwater a lot longer. That's a stalker. This is limestone. I need limestone. But I will take this oxygen. Oh, Jesus. That doesn't seem to give me like a whole lot anymore. Interesting. Okay, still fine though. So now we're just going to explore a little bit just so that I can have more stuff unlocked. By the blue, blue, it's like bow. Those give me seeds if I hit them. 30 seconds of oxygen. I'm hearing the big guys now. Still no ship explosion, but I am kind of glad that I've been filming for about an hour. Still got plenty of time to go, but I've made a lot more progress than I had before. Hey, I found the sea moth. At least a fragment. Clear waste disposal. Might be nice to have. A bioreactor. I'll take one of those too. Another sea moth fragment. I will take that. Absolutely. freaking -lutely. What's this blue thing? Oh, you're a creature egg. I don't care about you then. Where are you? Sandstone? Yeah. Wait. Was that gold? That was gold. So sandstone is also... Ooh, scanner room. Sandstone is also gold? I just want silver, PDA data. Hey, that's cool. Thank you for a new PDA data. Hello? Oh, hi. You seem to chase me around a little bit, but... Alrighty. Inventory's full. It is not. It's full for you, but it's not full for anyone else. And damn. Okay. I wonder how this video is going to turn out. Hopefully it's going to be uh, interesting for you guys. Salvage is full. I don't care about the salvage. I want parts. Parts. That's what I want. I want skinny things. Oh, hello. I will go over here, mister. Looks like I've run out of Emergency. A quantum detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive core. Uh oh. The reactor will reach a supercritical state. It 
Oh, the updates for this game. What the hell? Now we get the radiation. Alrighty. The Aurora is now gone. Um, we now have a new uh, uh, blueprint. So now we need to get the suit, which I kind of already have all of it. I say kind of because I still need to get the, the these things. I also have something on the radio. Um, that's not what you say. That's you don't want to say that while I'm listening to you. I'm pretty sure you're really good in VR and all that, but I don't need to hear that. <laughs> oh, I can craft one. Neat. Boop, boop. Uh, nope. Boop, boop. Okay, just need to get one more. I probably will need to get a uh, a thingy, a thingy, a thingy, a thingy, a thingy, a thingy. The mask for the radiation. Hopefully I don't, but I may have to. I just got the rebreather, which at lower levels isn't gonna, you know, do a whole. Well, if it's text is true, the rebreather is really helpful below 100 meters, but that's if the texts are true. I have no reason to doubt the text, but I have every reason to doubt the text. <laughs> now I got, so there's the radiation helmet, which I need to put on because this goes with the, that set there. And the rebreather right now gets put in the wonder chest. And so does this until I need to craft it down into something later. I'm kind of doing bad in food and water, so I'm gonna fill this up first. Food, water, to the code that I'm looking for. I will still need the um, laser thing though, because if I don't have the, the laser thing, it's not gonna do a whole lot. Food, and they sped up the game quite a bit. I, I really like that. I like that a lot. Okay, so I don't need this, and I don't need this. So what do I need? The laser cutter and the, the mobile thing. And radiation suit, scanner room, bioreactor, Seamoth. Seamoth is really, really freaking cool. That's what a peeper is. Violet blue. Okay, nothing, nothing, nothing. Ah, so nothing else, really? That's not good. And these are down here, I believe. Yep. Ah, dang it. Okay, 40, 44% off this. I need to go towards the ship now. I've got radiation gear, so I can go towards the ship now. Uh, how am I doing in supplies? I got enough of those, so I'm just gonna focus more on looking for the parts I need to find. Where's the ship again? I forgot where I died. Because I got the radiation suit, I should be able to survive in the radiation to a certain point, which means I can get more of the parts I'm looking for. Art and... Oh. There we go. And I should have an empty one right there. Oh, lead. I need that. Lead is for sure good. At least slightly. It's not as bad as I thought it was going to be when I first played this game. But that's where the rebreather is uh, really, really handy. So I can scan a trash can. Yes, but I just found pod six. What happens if I integrate? Oh, that thing. Green crap that shoots at me. Copper. I'll take copper. Copper's good. Copper is wise. Copper is heart. And mind. And body. Oh, so many bodies. Sandstone. Silver. Ow. I got shot by a green thing. I didn't like it. Ah, uh, where is the ship? That's what I was looking for this entire time. <laughs> there's uh, there's some more parts by the ship. I mean, it's going to take a little bit just to travel to and from, but there's more parts here. And that's most of the game, really. You are kind of surviving whenever you need to, and you're realistically looking for all these parts that you need so you can continue exploring, because without them, you're dead in the water. Which is what really sucked about my first playthrough of the game. I focused on the wrong thing. Which uh, kind of ruined my experience because I I bought this thinking that it was something different. 
And then when I realized that it wasn't at all like that, I kind of just want to do like a creative mode type thing, but I'm not going to learn anything. So I had decided against it. Oh, I'm going to scan these things. These things are huge enough. I can. A reef back. And... Thank you. You are a good leviathan to me. I'm really close to the ship now. Oh, let's get full oxygen. There we go. All right, neat. I really need to have the lights on so that I can see possibly what I'm looking for down here. I see a lot of deposits, but nothing, nothing too useful right now. A lot of deposits up there too. Some salvage gear. But nothing like super. There, and there, nothing there. Oh, you do you have something? You have something. A propulsion cannon. A weapon that I hardly got to use last time I played. It uh, died as soon as it got unlocked. It's kind of sad. I wasn't expecting it to. Which means what? Gladys. What does it mean? Gladys. Gladys. What's this? Power transmitter. I don't even know what that is. I'll take a health kit. I'm not getting close to the thing already, am I? Oh, yes I am. Holy... Oh... This is a hole! Why can't I... I can clearly go through that! Wouldn't be decreasing if I could just go through these freaking holes. Okay, I don't think I can find anything here to scan that'll unlock stuff. Now, I hear that. I hear that. Go away. I know you're around. You can stop that now. I know you're around. I don't know where, but I hear you, and you can knock it off. One more salvage. You're at 27% already? Bro, I didn't hardly use you. Actually, I used you a lot more than I should really announce, but Jesus. Priest. Oh, I know. Trust me. Trust me. Hello, Reefbacks. Don't mind me. I'm just going to pass right next to you so that I can go up to the air oxygen thing. <sighs> okay. Ocean cannon. Oh, yeah. They caught the fuel lines. All right. Just because I haven't been on the ship yet. Oh, that it, that was a Reefback. Okay. Thank you. We're not chomping on my bones so early. You are a very healthy, good-looking fish. Let me just go ahead and put that out there right now. As long as it doesn't get me killed, you are whatever you want to be. I'm not finding a whole lot of anything. Hello, what are you? Bioreactor fragment. Oh, I apparently already have that. And what about, oh, you, sir, are salvage. How about you, what are you? Another bioreactor fragment. Damn it. You're trash. Ooh, bar table. I'll scan that. That is a freaking forklift. Why can't I scan the forklift? Isn't that useful? Right? Isn't it useful? Nothing in there. Let's salvage. Already scanned those. I haven't scanned that thing yet. Something's in there. I don't want to go through there just yet. Another sand shark. It's my oxygen. Doing fairly well. Fairly well. About over here. Anything good over here? Salvage parts, salvage parts, salvage part. Door that looks like it can be opened? Probably not really, but... What was that sound? It sounded like something opened. 30 seconds. Something did open. Right there. Oh. Nothing opened. My sea moth lost power. Sea glide. Not sea moth. Sea glide. My sea glide lost power. All right, so, oh no. I'm also losing water too, which I do have. So that'll offset me just a little bit. We're gonna head back to the ship. I'm gonna try to make another battery. I should have enough copper to do so. It's slow going. But I, I have made like a considerable amount of progress within the it's about an hour and a half now, but when you guys see this, it's probably gonna be less than that. Also, something's weird. I'm gonna have to check this uh, after the recording. Uh, for some reason, the frames are dropping. 
Hopefully that's not reflected in the, uh, the final. If you guys see this video, then everything turned out great. If you have, if you don't, it, I'm not releasing footage that doesn't look good. So there's that. Like, sorry, my computer is good enough to be able to handle s stuff like this. And if it can't record this game in 60 FPS, it's a little bit of a damper. We can craft the beacon, takes copper ore and all that, but I need to go down here and grab a couple of those. Yeah, this, this, nope, this, that, that. Oh, I had one. Neat. Oh, that's probably why my battery dra uh, drained out so much. I had the light on. Who knew? Okay. Uh, we're going to put two of these in there. We're going to put these in there because I'll convert those into the power cell. And in here that I can craft. Give me copper wire. What copper do I have? Oh, I have plenty. So yeah, I'll make a uh, copper wire. So that's all that I'm going to do in crafting. I'm going to come in here and figure out what I can make now. Because that's going to really dictate what I go from here. Nothing new there. There. What's this? Oh, extends the range of power sources. Okay. That's actually kind of good. A uh, bioreactor composites organic matter into electrical energy. I don't really know what that does per se, but uh, we're probably getting to the point to where I'm going to need to build the habitat. And so I'm going to need a computer chip and this and the table coral sample. I think I know where that's at. It should be this and I just See, I have been studying. I have, I have, I have. And microchip, computer chip, I should say. And we got the advanced one. CPU used in advanced construction. So I need gold wiring kit and a computer chip. I don't know what to use that one yet. So I'm not going to. Do I have, I don't have the upgraded fins. Okay. So now that this is done, I don't need that. And what do I need? I need silver the wiring kit. As soon as I get the wiring kit, I'll have my habitat. Let's go out and get some food and water. Darkness helps me find these things a lot faster. And the peepers. I remember when those used to give me like the best food and water after cooking them. So I think that's all that I can really grab for now. And food, water. I'm still a little concerned that I haven't seen anything for uh, the code. That's that's troublesome for me, at least. I don't know about you guys, but it's troublesome for me. I have a lot of titaniums, which is good. I'm keeping those separate. That was one thing that I did wrong, too. That is made abundantly clear. Shouldn't have so many titanium ore, or um, ingots. And they're used for something. They're definitely used for something, but not right away. Okay, I seem to have gotten like quite a bit of ore, silver ore in these. Like so. I already got what I came for. Neat. Now we just head back over to the ship. Now where would the other items be? I still need the propulsion cannon and the laser cutter. I still need to find the other parts for the uh, other vehicle as well. And now we make the habitat builder. And the habitat builder is going to be very, very fun. Correcto. All right, but I think I'm going to call it there. It's been uh, quite interesting so far. I got a lot of stuff done that took me nine hours to do, <laughs> but uh, now that I kind of understand what the the whole pro uh, like premise of the game is, I'm going to focus primarily on exploration and not necessarily the survival part. If I get really good at the game, maybe I'll we'll play this in hardcore, but we'll see. Thank uh, thanks guys for watching. And as always, have a good one. See you later.